Having just recently snowed up in Big Bear, we decided it was time to venture out in the Rubicon's first snow run. We contacted a group of guys from the JK Forum that were making the trip and they graciously invited us to come along. The great thing about the off-road community is that you can come together with complete strangers with a common goal of having fun and adventure, helping each other out, and staying safe. This trip would be no exception to that. So after agreeing that we're all going to go hit the Gold Mountain Trail, we aired down and headed out on the road to go see what kind of adventure we could find. I fall off the field, I'm old enough to know better and too young to care. After about a mile of climbing the mountain and soaking in some of the scenic views, we came to our first obstacle. There are pretty much three main lines at this obstacle you can attempt. To the right is straight up with a difficult rock staircase. The center, a little more forgiving, and the left was technical and required some brute force to get over. There was an increased level of difficulty here that was making us work for it. But with some excellent teamwork, a little horsepower, and a knowledgeable ground guide, we all navigated this section without a scratch. Okay, admittedly we had to stack a few rocks just to make sure we got over the hump on a couple of these, but you know, sometimes that happens. Wow. Oh, <laughs> 
Our second challenge of the day would pose to be a little more difficult than the first. Unfortunately, one of the nearby tree roots grabbed a hold of one of the Jeep's tires and we had to all stop for a quick change. Although we barely knew each other's first names, we came together to make quick work of this tire change and we were soon back in action. This rocky section was going to challenge most of our driving ability because choosing the right line was the difference between moving forward or having to back up and do it again. Once again, our ground guide took charge and kept us out of trouble.
As we approached the crest of the mountain, we finally began seeing some good snowpack. We decided to stop for lunch and enjoy the views before heading down the mountain. But before we could head down the mountain, one of us needed a little helping hand. But no problem, we made quick work of it. The view of the trail all day long was amazing, and the snow and mud was a blast to play in. There was a few little rocky sections on the trail, but really, except for those two main obstacles coming up the mountain, the rest of the way was pretty easy going. We did hit a little jeep traffic on the trail as someone had found themselves stuck, but of course the off-road community stepped in and landed a hand. I would rank Gold Mountain Trail as one of my favorite trails so far. So if you're thinking about heading out and tackling this mountain, I would encourage you to do it with friends. Until next time, go out and find your adventure.